welcome to the show. This is awesome. Um, it is awesome. Wait, have you ever met Anne before? No. Is, and, then it's um, even more awesome. Yeah, you're a legend, rock star. Yes. This is the coolest. Thank you very much. Yeah. yeah. If we have time, I was wondering if we might play a few or start a band or... I mean, I know you're busy, but... Well, yeah, but not today. You know, okay, great. <laughs> we'll get yeah. the guitar. She <laughs> likes a road trip. If you offer up an Airstream travel, like, maybe she'll be into it. Um, <laughs> so what kind of kid were you growing up? Were you, like, easy on your mama? Just you know, asking. I, no, I was a little rambunctious. You know, okay. got into theater, talking too much, trying to make the other kids laugh, pretty much anything um, for a laugh. Yeah. That was like oh, me there as we a go. kid. We turned yeah. out all right. That was one of the few moments I was sweet. Um, so here you are as a kid, though, headed for school. This is... Yeah. First of all, I had a Goonies lunchbox did like you? that. I did. Oh, my God. I want I was, that picture. I was a huge Goonies fan. That's awesome. But um, were you into Rambo? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I, I Everything. Rambo, uh, Indiana Jones. <gasps> Love. Huge fan. Watched I got to rewatch with all my kids recently. Oh, really? So fun. Did you... Are you... Do you let them watch anything? Because I could watch just about anything when I was a kid. I do, and here's the reason why. They don't really notice. Things slip yeah. by them like they did me. So, but yeah. I will say, I watched Goonies with them, and yeah. I was like... that's a great one. Although, but, he's a little scary. Well, not just the scary. It's like, I'm like, they're around the entertainment industry, so they hear language, and I'm like, you can't curse until you pay your bills. Right. Um, so that's the rule in my house. <laughs> um, but but it's like, it was kind of like, oh my God, like, I watched this as a child. Like, it's like some of the stuff that happened in it. Yeah. But they don't seem phased by it, and I, I wasn't either, so. There was, we had a bunch of family and friends over, and everybody was going to watch It, the original, from like oh, 1990. Oh, hell no, I haven't watched that now. It's, Tiff, I was like six years old, and I begged my family to watch, and they were like, no, you got to go to bed, and all my cousins were there, and I was like, I'm not leaving. I'm watching this movie. <gasps> And I watched, and I went into a catatonic state yeah. of pure fear. And then my dad, who's a, a, a bit mischievous, uh, snuck around the backyard with nope. the It mask uh, and nope. knocked on the window and scared the bejesus out of me. I was nope. never the same. Yeah. So that, for me, was Freddy Krueger. Oh, really? Because Great my movie. my brother's like a decade older than me, and he they were watching, and I was like, I'm old enough too, whatever. Yeah. And I got in there. I will never sit on a waterbed. <laughs> no. I will never like. Didn't there, yeah, yeah, Johnny get Depp sucked in. To, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I was so scared. I was scared to death of yeah. cockroaches because how the box and the oh, oh my that god, sweater that sweater yeah. to this day is it's still terrifying. cool. No, it's terrifying. Terrifying. But in a cool way. When people dress up and I'm like, <laughs> I'm like Halloween. I'm like out with my kids like trick or treating. And yeah. I see someone dresses that, I'm like, it, get away from me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Beat it. Yeah. yeah. What would you beg your parents to let you do when you were a kid that maybe you weren't supposed to? Um, wear a mini skirt, I guess. Oh. And they always said no, so so You'd I'd wear the long skirt and then walk outside of the house and roll it up. And roll it. <laughs> Um, so wait, I heard you got a tattoo to remind you what it means to be human. So what's that tattoo? Oh, I got this tattoo that, um, it, it's savage, the word. I was reading this book, Sapiens, and it's about early man, and I was thinking about how we're all, well, there I'm naked, but, uh, That's all... apologies, but. Hey, but... if I was naked like that, I'd post it too. <laughs> like, I don't like, whatever. But I, I, I got this tattoo to remind myself of, you know, just that we're all the same human animal and, and, uh, you know, stay in touch with that, that that part of us that we're all the same. And then, and then of course, uh, a song came out, I guess, that made it, just took it a different turn. And then it became this pop culture thing that I was like, I didn't get it for that. I know, but I love that, like, I love, because it's like what, like, Kids say they're like, "Oh, you're so savage," and they're always, yeah, you know, it's exactly. always like, "And like you I'm have like this 37. Tattoo. Like I'm not a kid who should be saying savage, bro. Like it's yeah, just, I know, which yeah. makes it way better. Yeah. yeah. So now it's like, it's, I think it's pushing me into like dad bod. Oh my god, I love it. No, yeah. That is not a dad bod. Just letting you know. Um, so tell us, tell us about tomorrow's all new episode of New Amsterdam. Uh, we are coming to the end. I think we have two episodes left, okay. and uh, and we're building to a great finale. I'm I'm getting hitched on yeah. the show, which is exciting. Okay. Um, and uh, make sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, I hope so. And um, no, it's great. All the kind of relationships are coming to a head. People are getting married. People are breaking up. And uh, yeah. and you know, as you saw in the clip, I'm trying to get the hospital back from someone who was uh, taking it in the wrong direction. So yeah, yeah. I love it.